You were kind to me. I thought you were my friend. Am I not? You lied to me! I helped you break Zivu Aras' hold on the shore, brought you to the last city, offered you guidance. Stop. If that's what you want. I want the truth. I was kind to you because I wanted to be. Because the truth hurts. You know this better than anyone. Shrinking away from the rumors of the man you used to be. I'm not him. How can you say that when you don't even know who he is? If the truth is what you really want, then lay your hand on me. Crow, don't. Please. See? Even your ghost thinks you're better off in the dark. You show him everything. No, wait. You hurt him. Someone had to. Better for it to have come from a friend. Don't give me that look. I told you that you can't stop the inevitable. Deep down, Crow wanted to know. He was going to find out one way or another, guardian taboos or no. You should thank me. Just imagine if it had come from someone with bad intentions. Someone who could have colored the truth about how he died to turn him against you. Against the Traveler. But I would never do such a thing. I see too much of myself in him. We were both looking for our purpose. Now that the Crow has found his as a guardian, he can see it for what it truly is. A second chance. Something to reflect on. If people didn't want him to know, was it to protect Crow from himself? Or was it to protect themselves from Crow? I do so enjoy our talks. Aldrin Sav, a woken prince, brother to the queen, murderer. Now I know the man I was. And you. You. I'm sorry. You did what you had to do. I don't think I would have told me either. Savathun's visions were like a waking dream. I could feel the heat of the flames, taste the blood in my mouth. I saw everything he did through his eyes. You're afraid of who I used to be, that he'll come back somehow. I am too. So I've... Asked Ikor to put me on another assignment. One where I can be somewhere I know my choices are my own. Tell Mara. Tell her whatever you want. I'll see you again when I'm ready. <laughs>